Hey everyone, Christina from Elementor here. Ready to make your website pop without a coding degree? Today I'm showing you how to add eye-catching effects using Elementor AI. No complex code, just simple prompts to transform your site. Let's dive in. So here we have a beautiful website ready for those few extra touches. So first up, I'm gonna add a dynamic ticker bar to the span's website in order to grab attention and keep visitors engaged. It's the perfect spot to highlight important info like new merge drops, tour dates, and that hot new single. Plus, you can make it all clickable, turning your website into a powerful call to action machine. But hey, ticker bars aren't just for fans. You can use them to promote limited time offers, showcase testimonials, or share any news you want your visitors to see right away. Here's how it's done. Select each part of the ticker bar that you created. Go to advanced, click on the AI icon in the custom CSS tab. In the prompt window, I'll add my prompt in plain English. I click generate code. Now I'm gonna hit insert. We can now begin to see it moving. I now copy the CSS code to the second part of the ticker bar and apply the effect across the entire banner. To add that extra flair, I also tilted the ticker's axis. Amazing. In this next section, I wanna increase conversions for the band's merchandise and make it impossible to miss. I'm gonna bump up this section with a custom CSS effect without writing the code from scratch. I'll create a subtle hover effect on the product cards. On hover, each card will undergo a smooth scaling transformation, slightly increasing in size while the card moves to the front, drawing even more attention to the awesome products. So let's start by adding our prompt to the parent container. In my prompt, I'm targeting the hover effect on the child elements with the class eChild. This way, we're essentially future-proofing the design so we don't have to manually update the CSS every time we expand the product range. Now I should mention, as with other AI-generated tools, specific outcomes can vary even when using similar prompts, so please, don't hesitate to experiment with the prompt until you achieve the perfect effect for your design. Little details can make a big impact. So instead of an arrow cursor throughout the entire page, I've swapped the cursor for a vinyl record cursor, just in this one section. It's playful, it's on brand for our band's website, and it adds a touch of personality. So here's the prompt to change the cursor. Be sure to apply the code to the parent container. Nice. All right, let's keep that vinyl theme going. We've got this cool record image here, but let's give it some extra flair. We're going to use Elementor AI to create a captivating animation where the vinyl record appears to be subtly sliding in and out of the sleeve. To achieve this effect, we'll need a bit of custom CSS, but I don't want to write the code from scratch. So first, we'll apply a smooth vertical translation animation to the vinyl image itself, creating the illusion of it sliding. Here's the prompt I used. Next, I'll create a prompt to generate CSS for a subtle floating effect to the record sleeve. Now to add that extra touch, I'll add an animation to the shadow beneath the image making it grow and shrink horizontally in sync with the vinyl's movement. This further enhances the floating illusion. Perfect. So now we have a visually striking animation that draws attention to our call to action and encourages users to click listen now. All right, so let's revolutionize how we display upcoming concert dates. Instead of creating a carousel with navigation arrows, we're creating an interactive, visually stunning experience all powered by Elementor AI. Let me show you how. So using a simple text prompt, I can instruct Elementor AI to generate a CSS for a sleek, horizontal scrolling effect. But here's where it gets really cool. On Hover, I've used Elementor Flipbox to reveal the concert details on the reverse side of the card. You can also take it one step further and link each card to a different web page. It's a seamless user journey designed to boost conversions. And this technique isn't just for concerts. Think product showcases, 
team member profiles, portfolio highlights, the possibilities are endless. Elementor AI takes the complexity out of creating custom interactions. You describe what you want in plain text and it generates the code for you. Power users, this one's for you. Want to add some JavaScript flair to your site? Let's say you have a waitlist sign up. With Elementor's custom code, it's easy to add a confetti explosion when someone joins. So go to WordPress dashboard and under the Elementor menu, add a new custom code. Just tell the AI what you want. Colors, particles, shapes, the whole shebang. All right, so that's a wrap. We've taken a simple landing page and transformed it into an interactive, engaging experience. I hope this, you've enjoyed this walkthrough. It was a lot of fun creating this site. From floating vinyl records to scrolling concert dates, we've shown you the power of Elementor AI to bring your creative visions to life, no coding required. So, now it's your turn. Which effect was your favorite? Let us know in the comments below. I'm Christina from Elementor. See you next time. Elementor, create websites, design your future.